is me, Sarah. Welcome back to my channel. Before we get started with today's video, remember to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And without further ado, let's get on with the video. So today's video is going to be a book haul. So let's just dive right in. The first book I actually have downstairs is the book I'm currently reading. That is The Nanny by Lana Ferguson. I will pop a picture up on the screen so you can see. And this is a single dad nanny romance. And basically, she had an OnlyFans and he was her biggest fan on OnlyFans and now they meet again. She's going to nanny for his daughter and they don't know that they were the other person until she figures it out. And yeah. Next, I have Still Beating by Jennifer Hartman. This beautiful cover, which is the Bloom edition. Um, the indie edition is out of print. I'm pretty sure so this is the cover I have. This is a dark romance. Definitely look up trigger warnings for this. There is um, my biggest trigger actually, well like one of my biggest triggers is in this book actually, which is uh, S.A. Sexual Assault. Um, but I did still really enjoy this book because after part one, that is gone, but is to them dealing with the trauma and is their relationship it is not captor captive is not with the abductor it is they were kidnapped together and so they went through life and death situations together and then they just grew a strong bond and it is her sister's fiance and it is their relationship and i love this book so much next is another one i've read and that's icebreaker by hannah grace um this is a book that is amazing i love it it's the first book in the maple hill series and this is a figure skater and ice hockey um, romance. And it is Reverse Grumpy Sunshine. It is so good. I love it. And it is super spicy and just such a good time. I highly recommend reading this. And I'm super excited for the second one in the series to come out later this year. Next is one I have not read. And that is Twisted Lies by Anna Huang. This is the fourth and final book in the Twisted series. Which I love. I've given all three books five stars. And I'm super excited to get this one to get get to this one. Oh my god, words. But this one is a chunker, but I'm super excited to get to it. This is about Stella and Christian, and I am not as excited for this one as I was for the other ones, but I am still looking forward to it. I believe it is fake dating, and that is all I know about it. And I know it's going to be a spicy good time, because Anna Wong always writes such good books. So those are some books I got from Chapters, and then The Nanny I got from Amazon. But now let's get on to some books I got, a series I got from Value Village. And that is the um, Curse of the Gods series. So here are the five books. Um, I'm pretty sure this is the whole series, but we have they are by Jamie and Eve and Jane Washington. And the first one is Trickery, Beautiful Covers, and Persuasion, Seduction, Strength, and Pain. And these are a, I believe, fantasy romance reverse harem. So I'm super excited to read them. Never read a reverse harem before. We'll see if it's my thing or not. And I'm really excited to get to those. So those were all such a good price. I had to pick them up. And now on to the last books for this book haul, which I got from Amazon. Two of them were actually delivered today and one was delivered yesterday. The one that was delivered yesterday was Trick or Orc by S.J. Sanders. This is a Halloween romance, which sounds super cool. It is a novella. It is part of the Monster of the Yours series. And this is just over, it's like 138 pages. So super short. Hopefully it's good. I love this cover. It is stunning. And I know nothing about this except that it is a romance and it is an orc romance and I want to get into that. Um, Next, I have Ember, which is the first book in the Burn series by Emma Renshaw. This is a single mom romance. I, um, I think it's Second Chance. I'm not sure. Uh, but I don't really know too much about this. I just know it's single parent, and I'm super excited to get to it. And the last book I have is Strictly Off Limits by Jessica Hawkins. Again, this is a little novella. Never read from this author before. i um, super excited to. Let's see how many pages this is. 104. This is like super tiny. I could probably read this in one sitting. No, no, probably. I could read this if I wanted to. And I know absolutely nothing about this except that it is spicy. And, um, yeah, so she's taking a week-long job to earn enough money to buy her way out of a broken heart. 
but her new boss won't let her off easy because he's her father's best friend. This is dad's best friend. Oh my god, I'm even more excited to read this. So, definitely excited for all of these books. And if you made it this far, please leave me a tree emoji. And before you go, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the post notifications, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, everyone.